We are excited to present you our new bundle, the Zygmunt. Here's a quick overview. Lovely colors and cool hover effects. And it is fully responsive. Now let's see how you can set up Zygmunt on your website. Before we begin, here's something I would like to recommend to you. Go to Divi Team Options. Scroll down and make sure to disable these two options, Minify and Combine, JavaScript and CSS. Also go to Builder, Advanced and make sure to disable static CSS file generation. This will deactivate caching and code minification on your website. And this is a really great habit while you're developing your website. When you have done building your website, you can switch these options uh, back on if you prefer. First thing we want to do is to install the Assistant plugin. Go to Plugins, click Add New and then Upload Plugin. Click Browse button and navigate to files you downloaded. Unzip the zip file you downloaded and then select Zygmunt Assistant plugin zip file. Select it and click Open button. Now click Install Now button and in a moment the Assistant plugin is going to be installed. Click Activate Plugin button to activate the plugin. And also you'll need to add your API key. Click this Click Here link and add your API key and API email into these fields and save the changes. You can find your API key in the order email you received or you can go to our website and under my account go to API keys page. Now that you have the assistant plugin installed you need to add layouts to your library. There are two methods to add the layouts to the library. First one is to import the JSON file. You can go to Divi, Divi library, click import and export button, select import and then choose file. Once again, navigate to files you downloaded and this time select JSON file. Click open and then import uh, button. This is going to import all Zygmunt uh, modules and page layouts into your library. But have in mind that uh, this method is also going to import all the images to your media library. So you might don't want to do that. So before you do this, uh, let me show you the other method, the other way how you can import the layouts. And I think it's a better and easier way to do it. You can also import the layouts using Divi then on demand plugin. It's a free plugin that you can get from our website. You need to be logged in uh, and go to the page of the plugin and click the download button. Once you download it, go to the website and install the plugin normally as any other plugin. Go to plugins page, click add new and upload the zip file you downloaded. After that, go to settings and Divi then on demand. And here's the in interface you are going to see. On your left, there's a filters options you can use to easily find the layout you're exactly looking for and on your right there are all uh, filtered page layouts and modules. So if you just purchased Zygmunt you can toggle uh, filter options, check the Zygmunt and all the Zygmunt layouts will appear on your right and here's the great thing about Dividend On Demand. You can easily preview uh, all these layouts, you can see exactly how they look like you can also click the view button to better see uh, the layout, to see it uh, on an actual page. And also you can save any of these layouts or modules as easy as clicking the save button under it. So let me give you an example. Let's for example load this home page layout uh, on our page. All I have to do is to click the save button and this home page layout is going to be saved. Now I can go to a page and click load layout button. And here I want to select uh, your save layouts tab. And here it is the home page layout that I just uh, saved. And all I have to do is to click on it and 
automatically it is loaded onto the page. Now I can just publish this page and let's have a preview. And there we go. Here's the home page we just saved and so that's it. That's how it works. I believe this second method is much more convenient and I recommend you to use Dividend on Demand plugin. If you have any additional questions, do not hesitate to contact our support. That's it for this video and thanks for watching.